today we're gonna learn crate training. Hey, it's Aaron and Guppy, and today we're getting some puppy training tips with Shannon. So I know you're supposed to crate train, but to be honest, it kind of feels like a puppy jail. Oh, no, not at all. He needs his own space, his own zone. So think about it like his own little personal puppy man cave thing. Oh, you want your own little man cave? Yeah. Okay. With his special toys, everything. Oh. It'll be great. Oh, it sounds amazing. Do we have one? Well, we need one. <gasps> there you go. Oh, look, it's your own little man cave. Go check it out. Your brand new crate. Oh. So yes. what's the best way to get him to go in there without forcing him into the crate? Right, you never want to force him, because again, you want him to look at this as a positive. This is exciting. Yes! <laughs> Now, if there's ever a time like that where Guppy goes in all on his own, mm -hmm. you definitely want to mark it, praise him, and reward him. This yes. is a really good thing that he just did. <laughs> so to get started, we're going to start off with it in here, and we're just going to kind of be down here with Guppy um, and make him feel real safe and, and not try to close the door right okay. away on him. When we first start, how long should I keep him in there? I would only start with about five minutes and build your way up from there. What you. about when he starts crying and whining and calling for me? Oh, I know. That's the worst. <laughs> but Guppy! <laughs> but just be strong. I know it'll be hard, but Guppy will very quickly learn that all he has to do is whine and you'll let him out. Oh, uh, <laughs> yeah, we don't want that. Right. Oh. So now we need to get him to be able to go in the crate. Okay. So what I want you to do is I want you to take your treats, Guppy's favorites. Okay. And Got I want you right to... <laughs> Good boy. I'm going to let you try this out, Aaron. Okay. Guppy. Come out. Good. And now you want to lure him into the crate. Okay. Uh, Guppy, see it? In the crate. Oh, yes, good it. boy. Very good job. And how many times should I do this? You know, I would say let's start with about five or ten times. Let's just do it back times. to back a little bit. Are there any cues I should use when? Yeah, happens? you can use the cue crate up or go to bed. Whatever feels good to you, whatever comes natural. Crate up. I like it. I like it. <laughs> Guppy, crate up. Yay, oh, good yeah. boy. <laughs> As you notice that he starts to go into the crate, he's enjoying time in the crate, you can start to close the door on him and leave the room, leave him in there overnight. And then what you want to do is you want to establish something that lets Guppy know, hey, you can come out. You're done. It's wake up. Good morning. Whatever you want to use for it. Hmm. Free puppy. Okay. Comes a little more naturally to most people. What about rise and shine? Is that too long? No, that's perfect. Is that good? Yeah, so okay. let's try it. Let's try it. Crate up. And now open it and say rise and shine. Rise and shine. Yay! Yay! 